I think what are the plans of the team for the new season? Well, our goal yeah. is obviously to win this competition. Yeah. Okay. Um, and uh, I, I suppose the first big step in that uh, direction is getting through to the playoffs. But any sporting team and, uh, and any serious venture would always chunk those goals down uh, to what is uh, uh, more achievable in the shorter term. And our focus right now is on the Delhi game on, the, on Saturday at our home venue for the very first time, which is super exciting for us. But that's our first goal, really, mm -hmm. is that first game, play well in that first game. Uh, so how do you take Delhi Capitals? Well, we'll have, obviously, individual plans uh, for them. Um, uh, they're a quality side. They're well led, obviously. Um, and every IPL team will have match winners in their, in their, in their 11. Um, and, uh, and we will have uh, individual plans for them. And in last two in last 20, 20 match in Ikana Stadium, there were only 200 runs in near about 40 overs. What you have observed in this pitch? Yeah, so uh, that is a relevant question, absolutely. And to be quite frank, um, we're not sure exactly what to expect from the pitch at the moment. Uh, you know, uh, we had a day off yesterday, so we weren't at the stadium, so we didn't see, I haven't seen how it's panning out, uh, the, the preparation of our playing pitch, which is on strip number four. Um, so when we get to the stadium tonight, we'll be able to make a better judgment of what we think the pitch is going to play like. But even now, it's quite a long way out from, uh, from Saturday. Um, so we don't want to um, judge the pitch too early. Mm -hmm. I, you know, that would be silly for us to do. We don't want too many preconceived, preconceived ideas about how it's going to play. But of course, we, we can use our cricketing judgment and experience um, on the day looking at it. You know, we will have plenty of selection options available to us. Um, and, and now with the impact player, you can, you've got a little more flexibility about um, how you exploit those conditions as well in real time. So, so in summary, uh, as an answer to your question, we will wait and see how that pitch pans out um, and make as good a judgment on it as we can prior to playing. And then we will deal, uh, we'll, we'll deal effectively with it as we play. Uh, one question is that uh, Aram Fitch has prediction that uh, um, Lucknow Subhanjan doesn't qualify the playoff. What is your reaction? Aram Fitch, a prediction. Oh, did he? Uh, yeah. Oh, um, Aram Fitch. Has a prediction that uh, Lucknow Supreme Joint doesn't play uh, qualify the playoff okay. because his uh, middle order is very poor and a uh, uh, doesn't qualify place the ball and some middle and the order death overs. You see, and death overs. Okay, well, 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 I haven't um, I haven't heard exactly what he said, so I'm not <clears> going to comment too much about what he said. But um, you know, last year we might not have been. Uh, 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 expected to qualify, and we played some outstanding cricket to be to be third in the table at the end of the round games, um, and, uh, and and made the playoffs quite comfortably, um, and just missed out on a top two slot, which was actually important um, last year. So uh, I don't I don't really mind what other people predict. Um, we are very confident in the players that we've got in our squad. We think we do have a lot of bases covered. Um, and whatever conditions uh, we we find over our 14 games, I think we can select good 11s uh, from it and have good impact players who can come in um, and uh, and make a difference in the 11. Uh, so um, when you're playing international cricket or franchise cricket, you hear a lot of opinions. And, um, and, you know, that, that will be one of hundreds or thousands or, in this country, millions. So, um, I, uh, it, it's fine. Everyone's entitled, entitled to their opinion. Uh, some uh, Lucknow cricket fans are saying that Lucknow Super Joints uh, uh, players, yeah. Mohsin Khan, has injured, so he faced difficulties in tap overs and middle order. What do you say, sir? Um, I... I I, uh, look, Mohsin Khan was a brilliant performer last year, um, and yeah, I thought he, 
you know, his season last year showed how quickly someone can move up in importance just in a, in a matter of weeks. So um, uh, that's, I think that's really exciting for any young cricketer to witness. It's, uh, it, is a it is a blow uh, not having him. There's no doubt about that. How much you are satisfied with Rahul's batting? Well, firstly, I love watching him bat. You know, he's a since, he, since he is also a globeman, like you. Well, I'm not that bothered about his globemanship. <laughs> uh, but he's a beautiful batsman to watch play. Mm -hmm. um, and his output in IPL cricket is just incredible, if you look mm -hmm. at his statistics. Absolutely incredible. Um, I, I like the fact that as a captain, he can lead from the front as a player as well. And he does that in all sorts of ways, you know, um, certainly on, on the batting front, but the way he looks after himself uh, physically and mentally and emotionally, um, the way he's calm under pressure, uh, the way he prepares uh, for each match. Um, you know, he's a good role model for the, the rest of our squad. Uh, so, I'm expecting great things from him. I love watching him bat. Um, from just watching him in training, he looks in uh, good enough form uh, that I, from what I can see. And we are expecting him to do really well.